guy the... guy with a sword versus versus 50 cops mm, yeah i remember you bro how you been man it is April 3rd, 19 April 3rd, 1997. And in the city of Seattle, Washington, at around 11 a.m., 911 operators Did you do anything would receive today? a call that would change the course of history. Okay, Hello, chat to me. Guy with a sword versus 50 cops. Oh my god, he was feeling like fucking. Oh, a, uh, black man, he's carrying something that looks like a samurai oh, okay, sword. Okay, calm down. Please don't look <laughs> the profile. He, does he appear to be dangerous? He's just standing there, but everyone's is your... freaking out. What is your current location? You've seen this. Okay, I want you to stay on the line. I'm going to alert- There's a black man with a fucking- with a, with a samurai sword! Okay? This call triggered an 11-hour standoff, which would forever immortalize the name of the what? Seattle Street Samurai. No way he's just standing there. Fuck off. Fuck off, he's just standing there with a samurai. Now this nigga cold, bro. He, he, yo, he feels like, what's that? Who's that guy with the zombie, bro? The black guy. Blade, man. He looks like Blade right now. Man's got the shades and everything with a bull, bull, man. What? I'm N word. What? Refuses to surrender his weapon without a fight. There's talks about this guy online, but they're yeah, from Blade. forever ago. So I just thought I'd make a contribution by putting this amazing story in a digestible video. Form. Yo, what's good, Theo? We just to reacted to that this. Nobody had made a we're gonna, we're gonna hop on Skyrim this very soon. Is insane. With nothing but sunglasses and a samurai sword. That's so. I can't lie. Even though it's kind of fucked, bro. Even though it's kind of fucked, because you don't know what to do, bro. You don't know what to do. Bro, he's just cold, man. I don't care, bro. He didn't commit no crime. He just done a standoff. That's all he done. His name. This man <laughs> held off That's so cold, bro. I'm not even lying. For 11 hours, he would stood everything from getting shot to receiving a bribe in the form of a Big Mac. Oh, and just stood That's there. a crime. I know it's a crime, but yo. Nah, imagine just telling your kids that, bro. <laughs> that, that. That'd be too funny. I'm I'ma play it today. I'ma play it today. But if you have to go to bed, it's all good. Name is Tony Allison. But on this day, oh, I he had a cool ass name, that bro. everybody, including the police, refer to him as Apollo. Mm. And it all started with him doing nothing. Yeah, it didn't actually start with that 911. Bro, it's all call. good, man. It was fake. Uh, it's all good, bro. It was actually an off. What's your opinions on the Kanye album? And Kanye album was cool. I felt like it lacked. I don't know replayability for me, but. I know how I am with Kanye. You get me? It was it was yo, it was just. I know I I didn't mind it as much. I rated it like a seven point five. He was alerted about a man in camo pants and a leather jacket that was quote unquote. Disturbing. Yeah, I need to, so I need to re-listen to it. I'm not gonna lie. I do need to decides to follow him from Pike's Place Market to the corner of Second and Pike. Joe, bro, you're off duty. Dry hard mud. This dude clinically this insane. This is where you see him in the video. Now Apollo was that's generous. Of this nah, guy man, it wasn't bad him, for me. Rightfully so. I would be as well. So that's true. I wasn't expecting him to cook that well. Defensive stance with his sword at the ready, which is understandable in a defense situation. Like nah, I can't this. lie. When he's got on this back, that's too off, cold, bro. Cop to call his buddies. And they would remain in that same location for the next eleven hours. I would they say six. All the stores evacuated everybody. Mm. Shut down all the streets. I didn't hate it. I feel like six is like when there's are wondering whether he's at least three or four bad songs i didn't i didn't I, I hated like maybe like one or two seek out a trustworthy source so the man confirms i can't lie i can't lie because he's got a taser bro just go up to him fucking no not taser if he's got a samurai sword go up to him and fucking tase him bro did these men not have tasers in america it's getting better and better that's usually how it is with with Kanye, bro just tase him and then his body will like start to like you can't you can't stop a taser bro Fears. yeah he knows how to use the sword when the cops got there, he knows how to use a sword they what? tried to bribe the samurai sword out of his hand with a glorious sum of how much fifty dollars what you think a guy this menacing is gonna yo he wants a he wants maybe like he wants 10 bags bro for that have you not seen that the guy that brushed off the taser? What? This guy here. I need to take one look at this guy and guess how he responded. I've seen guys no, generally tank that shit, bro. It's not normal. Didn't say 
anything for the entire 11 hour standoff except mentioning he had brothers in china and russia and correcting <laughs> police officers when they wouldn't refer to him as apollo he also said that he was possessed by demons and wanted to kill them uh, he talked I'm about to look at that, uh, uh, satan he talked about his brothers in russia and china but he never really engaged the uh, negotiated but yeah, he just refused to drop the Nah, sword. the way he's just oh, walking around. I can't imagine why. However, the police did not give up here. Nah, they went back to the drawing nah, board. Nah, 11 out, like, at what point? After an hour, you need to, you need to start to come up with, like... You get me? There's, there's levels to this, bro. Why can't you do it? Just shoot his fucking leg, bro, at this point, bro. I love, love Theo, bro. Crack. <laughs> Conspiracy ass music. Came up with another offer. No, I can't uh, uh, make this shot. Another offer. Yo, I, I can't like. Chat, how much you taking, bro? How much you taking for this, bro? That's like a negotiation. You're just standing there with a samurai sword, yeah? For like, what? Let me say six hours, bro. Six hours. What are you offering? Like, like what are they. What's, what's making you move? One mil. Oh my. One mil. You, you little, like, you a fuck, bro. I said one mil. I can't, like, 100 back. Guy like, takes a taser, like, I can't, like, 100k might, yo, 100k might get me, bro. 20 pound and a freight <laughs> 65k and a pack of crazy sour skittles. <laughs> Nothing. Wait, wait. Let me, let me put this up. Guy takes a taser like it's nothing. <laughs> Oh, I seen this. Yeah, I remember this. Man ripped it out. Now that's a menace right there. I can't like you. Just shoot him. You shoot him. Guy probably eats bullets. Where I'm going? done. Come that man, yo, maybe he's not bulletproof, but that man is taser proof, bro. I tell you that. You get me? <laughs> Fucking immune to that shit, bro. A Big Mac. No, I'm serious. This is real. a Big Mac. Now nah, you're taking a piss, bro. Is a Big Mac even worth ten dollars? Wait, or $50? Wait, first they offered him $50. Now they're offering him a Big, a, him a Big Mac. Bro, they're taking a piss now. They offered him McDonald's. This is targeted. Then they assumed since he was unmoved by this, he must have a mental health history. So they tried triggering schizophrenic urges. Of course, he was unmoved by these childhood <laughs> Six with inflation. continued to stand his ground. So the police weren't sure what to do next. Since he wasn't attacking anybody, they had to get the sword out of his hand. They thought about throwing a net over him. They shot him with tranquilizer darts, which had no effect. What? What the fuck? Oh my, oh my god. I was about to say something fuck too. Oh my, nah, let me chill. Oh my god. Oh, I was about to say something. I don't know if you guys remember that scene in Jackass where they shot Johnny Knoxville with one of these things. It's considered less lethal. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. He's on, he was on the ground bro. panting for like 20 minutes. Look, he just shrugs it off. Anyways, two unfair nut shots later, he was still standing. But he endures round after round and shows no sign of surrender. So That's not no normal human, The best bro. route to take is to tear gas him. The man shakes off the tear gas with almost superhuman strength. <laughs> Spray him with nah. a fire hose. <laughs> that he through, lose his this guy went through the fucking Hunger Games, bro. Like, what the fuck? It's like some Squid Game shit. Bro, this man would be a demon in that shit. Demon! Tear gas, bro got shot with a tranquilizer that Bro got shot with a fuck yo Man got s yo a whole hose like a fight yo them bitches be yo They be mad strong He tanking all that Oh my god nah, this guy's fucking I can't I'm trying I'm trying to be him Like when it comes to strength on the sword. Bro, came straight from an anime. <laughs> when that doesn't work, they turn the water pressure up. <laughs> full Look blast. at him. And then pin him down with a ladder. Those guys, oh, man, that poor guy, bro. By the book, exactly what they were supposed to do. Oh, pfft. yeah, of course. I'm pretty sure this is the definition of by the book, actually. Now, when oh. you look at this from the outside, who is in the wrong here? Oh, Guns God. with special bean bags that strike with the same impact as a heavyweight boxer's punch. Chemical agents or tear gas. Makes the suspect very uncomfortable. Burns his eyes. Yo, that's that is so. I'm just like, now nah, the tranquilizer darts got it, bro. Man, man shot two it acting like bean bags are gonna hurt me. It burns his skin and it makes it difficult from the Now breathe. the Tigas one would be fucked. Of water pack the force of a hurricane wound. He tanked that shit too. Orchestrated maneuver. Police the water, the, the water though was yeah, that's fucked. Pull 
and riot shoot. I said a ladder pole and a riot. What? They were supposed to do. Yeah, I. He's yeah, the winter I, soldier. I don't know. You, you guys don't want to know my opinion. What do you guys think? I'd love to see you take one. Excessive <laughs> force? Let me know in the oh, comments. And you might think this man's had enough. But the tragedy of Tony Apollo Allison's story is not done. As it turns out, only a year prior to the sword incident, Tony Apollo Allison was released from Western State Hospital after finishing a 10 year sentence. Oh, from a no. charge in which he pled not guilty due to insanity. Oh. The charge of second degree assault with intent to. Before this incident, he was. Wait, so he, he got away with it because he was insane? What? Am I tripping? A charge of second degree assault with intent to rape. Before this incident, he was an alcoholic wandering the streets with a sword on his back. And now he's a man with his name engraved in history. He was later sent back to Western State Hospital. Nah, he really is that. He's, yo. <laughs> yo, he is a bad man. I'm not, yo, he's a bad man, like. his current whereabouts are unknown until now in a twist of events i think i might have just found him or at least some potential evidence he's still i want to watch blade now i want to watch Back blade in 2021 a dad was with his son at bitter lake playfield and while passing by a homeless encampment spotted this oh shiny no sticking out of oh the he's the got he's back at it happens to be about 50 miles away from western state hospital Bro, or fuck this guy, a mere 8.2 so miles away the air, from where this whole thing began now, due to Apollo's story being very old and many news sources doing very minuscule amounts of deep diving and just very little information in general, I had to resort to these two blog posts excessively. And this one's got a really neat website. So <laughs> I don't know, bro. You get me? Aliens. If there's a man named Apollo, he's always going to own a sword. He's not Apollo if he doesn't have a sword with him. That makes him. The sword makes Apollo. You get me? That is him. He is one with a sword. He is the samurai. Cover up stuff. Go check it out. Don't forget to subscribe.